Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. If your dream is to become a data analyst or a data scientist, then cracking the SQL interview is a very important stage for attaining your dream job role. Myself, Emily Prasad, I am a mentor for data science and analytics. I can help you overcome this obstacle by explaining all the various questions asked in the top companies which are available at the LeetCode platform and all the code solutions which are uh, available in LeetCode platform have been solved and the solutions are there in my GitHub repository. The link for that is available in the description below. In addition to that, I have also segregated the channel into 5 playlists namely easy, medium and hard depending upon the difficulty of the question, the premium level subscription questions as premium playlist and all 230 questions into one single playlist ordered by their sequence number according to the platform. Let's see the question which I am trying to solve it today. It is type medium question number 2020 number of accounts that did not stream. Okay, let's see the question in action. Okay, it is asked in some US company called Warner Media. It consists of subscription table where a person has account ID and from which date to which date he has a subscription and the second thing is stream. Okay, if he has a subscription whether he streamed or not the session ID when he has done something the account holder subscription uh, account ID will be there here also and when he did the streaming it will be there here. Now write a SQL query to report the number of accounts that brought a subscription in 2021. Okay, first condition they should be having subscription in 2021 but did not have any stream session. Okay. The query result. Okay, let's see this one. Okay, let's see for the account ID 9. He started in 2020 and uh, ended in 2021. So he has a subscription in 2021. He is right. Let's see whether he streamed anything or not. The question is they should have a subscription in 2021. Right? But they should not stream in 2021. This person has a subscription in 2021. Let's see whether he streamed or not. Yeah, he did not stream in 2021. Okay, now this is right. 9 is right. Let's see for the next thing. This person also has a subscription in 2021. Okay, 3 also has subscription. 3, okay, 3 streamed in 2021. So this is wrong answer because he should have an account but he should not stream it. Similarly for 11, he brought in a subscription for 2020-2020 only. So he did not have any subscription. So this doesn't matter. Account 13. He also has an account from 2020-21. So he has a subscription 2021. What is the account ID? 13. But he again uh, streamed in 2021. So this is also wrong answer. Let's see for the next ID 4. He brought from 2022 to 2021. He has a subscription. Let's see for the 4 again. But yeah, and again he streamed in only 2020 only. So this answer is also right. Because he has a subscription but he didn't. So 9 is correct. 4 is correct. Similarly for the last row who is streaming from 2022 to 21. He has also a subscription. 5 has a subscription. But 5 again has what? streamed in 2021 so this is also wrong so how many accounts has subscriptions two let's see two are the number of people who have subscribed okay let's see the same logic here now how we need to do from subscriptions a in a join streams b such that a dot account id equal to b dot account id let's select all first of all let me show you okay we have created all the records which are there but uh, what is the condition the stream date should not be what in 2021 
where b dot stream date year of should not be equal to either you can keep like this or greater than or equal to symbol in ms sql 2021 let's run it okay here you can see there are three people again from this if you see here it should be starting before 2021 the start date and the end date should be from 2021 to other here you can see the date is starting from 2020 and it's sending at 2020 so one more condition is end year of a dot start date it should be less than or equal to 2021 and year of b dot sorry a dot end date should be greater than or equal to so that they will be in this subscription range only let's run it again okay these are the person only 9 and 4 has subscription in this range and they did not stream so now what you will want only count of rows as yes, accounts count as okay that's it let's run it okay let's submit it yes your solution has been accepted by the platform thanks for watching my video if you want more detailed explanations like this please subscribe to my channel and share it with your friends or colleagues who are preparing for a data scientist or a data analyst interview and uh, focusing on their sql round just be disciplined complete all the 230 questions which are there in the lead code platform the solution of that are available in my channel just try to complete it one day you will be able to crack your sql round thanks for watching